Now here are a very strange pair of words. Woman and its irregular plural, women. They are very similar with only one small sound difference. The only difference is how we pronounce the O in each word. Now it's important to remember that in English, pronunciation does not always follow spelling. Both of these words are spelled with an O, but neither O is pronounced as you would expect. Woman is singular, used for just one female. The O in this word is pronounced like the double O in the words book and good. This sound is pronounced with your lips rounded, your mouth a little open, your tongue is pulled back, and the muscles of your face and jaw are relaxed. Repeat after me. Book, good. Now both words are stressed on the first syllable. So that means that the W-O-M is louder and longer. Our first syllable holds the primary stress. And our second syllable is going to be a weak stress syllable. So you will pronounce the vowel in that syllable as a schwa sound. Now if you remember the schwa has a sound like this. Uh. It's quiet, relaxed, and neutral. And if you need to, please review the video lesson on the schwa. Now let's try the singular form together now. Woman. Woman. That woman is my boss. Now the plural is women. Here, the O is pronounced as a short, relaxed I sound. It's the same I as in the words it, will, and wind. You'll notice this is also a very relaxed sound. You should not feel much tension in your mouth or your jaw. So relax all the muscles in your face. The I sound is a front vowel, meaning that the, your tongue will be touching your lower front teeth, as so and your mouth will be a little bit open again. So, eh, eh. Let's go ahead and pronounce those words. It, will, wind. Now let's go ahead and try that out on the plural. Women, women. This spa is only for women. Now compare these two sentences. Only one woman works here. Only one woman works here. And then this one. Five women work here. Five women work here. What other words can you think of that have irregular plurals? How about foot and feet, child and children? There are several others. I suggest that you review them and make sure that you're using the correct plural in your conversation. Thanks for watching.